Imagine getting paid just for sharing your thoughts on products and services you use every day. With Survey Junkie, it's that simple. Click on the link in the video description to discover how you can start earning today by taking surveys. A prominent Sydney socialite has been swept up in another Photoshop scandal. Susan Mutisai, who boasts over 1 million followers on Instagram, was suspected of using an editing app like Facetune or FaceApp in one of her recent posts. In the image, the 37-year-old lifted up her shirt to show off her figure as she posed at a gym. Her face looks suspiciously smooth and glossy, and is a different shade to her body, a dead giveaway of a face app touch-up. Adding to the speculation is Susan's midriff, which also appears to be shiny and looks much different to previous images of her midsection. However, the difference could be down to a number of reasons, such as lighting and angles. It comes after Susan recently posted an event picture which was very different to the red carpet version at the Shine pop-up store launch in Melbourne in September. She looked every inch the glamazon in an Instagram photo from the soiree, highly editing a picture taken by an official photographer. The Ugandan-Australian appeared to have a much lighter complexion and elongated legs in her amended photo. Meanwhile, the red carpet snap taken by the event's official photographer showed Susan looking slightly shorter and wearing far less makeup. She told Daily Mail Australia at the time, she has her iPhone to thank for all her flawless images, as well as Facetune and Photoshop. Sometimes the main photographer will not bring their lights. So not all the camera settings are set to accommodate for a dark-skinned girl or other skin tones, she explained to Daily Mail Australia. It depends also on the room. Sometimes the lighting in the room, like the room is beautifully decorated but it's got shadows and it's dark. Susan explained she often makes sure to use the ProRaw settings on her iPhone before having someone else take snaps of her from low angles. She then puts them through apps like Facetune and Photoshop on her phone to create a more enhanced version of her red carpet pictures. It helps when you have a good foundation obviously. If you don't look amazing you're not going to get the best shot, she joked. As for the dark smoky eye makeup which suddenly appears in many of her Instagram photos, Susan said poor lighting is to blame. That's what happens when you have down lights. It dims your face, it doesn't lighten it up, she said of her official red carpet snaps. So when I brighten up that photo, it highlights the features and the eyes. But you can also go on photo tune and highlight your eyes in a way that heightens the liner just a bit so you see exactly how the eye is. Susan revealed her favorite go-to editing app is Facetune which she will often use for event photos when there is poor lighting. She said the iPhone Photoshop app also makes it into her arsenal sometimes, but you have to make sure your photo is in a good setting before you edit it in the app. Having those settings before taking the photo helps you amp up your photo because you can't just drastically go from one thing to the other unless you're just having fun, she said.